Hey guys, this is Seth here with yet more Terraria. I, I'm not kidding when I say I've recorded probably a good 10 episodes or so. I mean, I can't... I'm trying to... I'm thinking of that off the top of my head, but... Yeah, quite a bit. But yes, guys, we're making yet another pit stop. Another trip. Back to the main world. Because of all the ice items we've gotten now. And honestly... I don't really think there's, like, I think there's one more, like, uh, there's still more stuff to look at, and I'm still wondering if there's even a desert that has a pyramid in my, in the worlds I've been in, because so far there hasn't, and I'm none too pleased about that either, but I think if I recall correctly, they're rather rare, problem is they have some good stuff in there, so... We got the uh, walking fish again. So anyway, we have the bee stuff, we have the crimson stuff, and now the ice stuff is going to be in here. If the uh, lagging would stop. Thank you. Oh, damn, I didn't realize I had that many. Okay, then. I had a lot more uh, ice stuff than I thought I did. In terms of uh, ice blocks and all. By the way, the uh, ice torches, so that way I just have them reserve and stuff. Anyway, slush blocks. I just put them away, didn't I? Um, I know I'm not imagining things. I had... Oh, there they are. Alright, so... This item will be placed. Not actually... Uh, so willy-nilly. I don't even know where there's a good spot. Oh, here's one. There we go. So. Slush, do your thing. Oh, I saw platinum. We, Ladies and gentlemen, we have some platinum ore. For the very first time, some platinum ore. Silver ore, apparently. But this isn't enough, guys. Remember, there is silt I have, too. There's also apparently a goldfish in the house. Okay, let's see. I have snow all the way here. Stone pearls and silt. Ash works, too, from what I recall. Okay, so let's do this. Oh, guess it doesn't work with that. Look at all these ores. Saw some diamonds in there. There you go. Boy, I got a lot of jewels out of that. Kind of wish you could use the ash block, though. Last, apparently not. Still can't resist doing that, can you, game? Anyway, all these ropes. Um, looking for the, uh... Why am I even carrying this? There you go. Alright, now to find the area with all the gems. Here you go. These in there and this. Diamonds. I actually have very few diamonds, which is strange, I know, but... Alright. These two in here. Actually, the flurry boots should be going up here, shouldn't they? So, those right in there.
Okay, so... Right, the ash block will go here, then. Needs to say... Um, uh, now what to do with all these... Yeah, I'm gonna just gonna... I'm just gonna put all these statues in here for now. Oh, there's where the Silver War went. Okay. Put this up here. Get rid of yet more gel. And now, last but not least, time to smelt all this stuff. Okay. Definitely getting a lot of wars today, but I guess that shouldn't be any surprise, huh? Okay then. So with all this stuff now, can add yet another. I can add yet another set of bars into there. So gold goes here. Here. Platinum, I guess, is gonna go here. Iron. Silver. And you say, I think I'm all set in terms of, uh, bars. Where was this? There it is. Copper and lead. Alright. And of course a platinum ore. Look at all these ores I have now. It's insane. Absolutely insane. But anyway, guys, I think all that remains now is to just scout the world coming up. See if we get anything. Um, because there's really nothing else to do here. Um... There is still goldfish in the house. There. Alright, close it shut. And with that, should be able to uh, go ahead and check out the other world now. So we're getting there, guys. I mean, it doesn't seem that way, but we are making progress. I mean, it's just taking a while because of how long it took to deal with the snow biome. I mean, that was a long episode. Like, there is no doubt in my mind that was a long episode. Um, it went for a whole hour, actually, of going into the snow biome and getting the items, so... I'm definitely not out of the woods yet. There's still items underground that I'm sure that I can get. It just isn't in the uh, snow biome. Because I think I've covered the snow biome now. Um, there are still, as I said, you know, things I still need to get. Um, I'm nowhere near finished. Nowhere even close to being finished. So... Because, remember guys, I still have hard mode to do. <laughs> you know... This is all pre-hard mode. Look at all the stuff I've been getting in pre-hard mode. It's pretty crazy. Anyway. Getting all that. Now, because this is a medium world, I'd imagine... 
uh, the flowing islands won't be too difficult to reach. Anyway, here's where we went down. That's where I went down to, you know, get everything. Oh, there's a desert here. Hopefully there's a pyramid. I just find it strange that I have not seen a pyramid yet. Are they that buried in the ground or something? Oh, well, it doesn't matter anyway, because we have ourselves a tree. And it just interrupts itself. I really don't know how they expect you to uh, get anywhere with the uh, pyramids. It, it seems to me like it's not going to be easy by any stretch of the imagination. So. Um, gotta keep an eye out then. But yeah. Oh, well, there's more desert here anyway. Wow, this is a giant hill. I need to check a take a look at that again. more desert right here. I've seen so much desert, but not a single pyramid. There's usually a good sign that you may have stumbled across one, you know. There is a good sign that you have stumbled across one, so... I haven't been able to see it because, well, game hasn't been spawning them, so... Wait, why is there... chest here. Oh, there's some lead. Did not mean to do that, but whatever. At least silver coins. So it really does seem to me like this has been, you know, it, it definitely seems to me like this has been quite a uh, struggle. No question in my mind, getting Finding a pyramid definitely seems to be more troubling than I thought it was. Let's see, get rid of that. And float upwards, you know, just because. sand. Seriously, I've seen so much desert and yet none of them have any pyramids in them. We 
have, however, found the dungeon. And I guess we may as well take out Skeletron while we're here, then, so things don't get boring, but first things first. See what's behind the dungeon, and then come back here. Just checking for floating islands, because th those have been changed radically, too. I think this is the uh, end of it right here. Yep, it is. It's just we have a breathing reed, but you know what? I'll take all this. Actually, now that I know... Like... I can't take this with me. I'm taking this with me. If I can take with me, that is. Oh, there you go. I did not mean to throw even more down. Whatever. And now it's time to make the uh, long trek back. Well, to the dungeon, anyway. Can I block any of this off? Like, I imagine I could. Move the glow sticks out of the way. And There we go. Door's draining out the last of it, so... Now, as you guys can see, the dungeon has gotten quite a uh, reboot as well. But we can't really experiment on the dungeon yet, because we kind of have a little business to take care of in the in the uh, way of Skeletron. So this is our official rematch with him. Um, I really don't know where how this is gonna go. <laughs> to be quite honest with you, I really don't know. But we're about to find out. We're just waiting for it to be uh, nighttime. Okay, I can definitely see that there's still water. But... Yeah. Isn't there a... Uh... 
How do you get rid of the books now? Oh, like that. Okay, that's something I can do. I can just... Take out all those books. Don't worry, I'm gonna free you your curse. You just gotta be patient here, because, you know, it's kind of not nighttime yet. You're disabling the map so I can't... I can focus on the boss. Okay. Just waiting for it to be night time. Is it night time yet? Boy, they're very picky about nighttime now, aren't they? There you go. Curse. Here we go. The damage I'm doing to him. Just remember, I can strike multiple hits. Oh yeah, he's a cinch right now. Oh, he's a cinch. <laughs> Down he goes. I think I caught everything in mid-air, too. So what did I get out of this? Look like I got much of anything. Unless everything I didn't catch everything in midair after all. Yeah, I don't see much in the way of anything. That's so weird. I don't think I got anything out of that. Well, at least I can get into the dungeon now. Okay. So I can't turn the map back on. Hi there. Didn't take long before they started showing up again, but yeah. The main reason why I'm in here is to check to see if there are any new items. If there are, there are. If there aren't, there aren't. But... We shall see, though. Did not mean to do that. Oh, 
shit, spikes. More spikes. Okay. Yeah, you can see that this is kind of a big area. Oh god, hi. Yeah, you can see the new thing right here as well. Damn it. More lag. Now, do I have a key? No, I don't. Maybe I can do something about that. I don't know. Guess thing by doing this. Sudden ambush. I still don't have any keys, seriously? This is just a pickle. I'm picking up any books in case they're, uh, rare ones. And none of them are dropping any keys. There's a golden key. Now I can hop up here and get this one. Shadow key. Off. Don't need you. Definitely need you. Bone workbench, really? Okay. May as well take this gold chest with me. There's still another golden chest, though, that I haven't opened, so... And this is where all the water went to. Uh. And we found another chest. That I can't open. I really should have brought my uh, keys with me, I think. 
the game certainly isn't dropping any keys, I'll tell you that much right now. Another key. Not another key, but a, another chest that I can't open. I don't know how the, how I don't know how the game expects me to uh How the game expects me to get anywhere here if I'm not getting any keys. That, uh, that awkwardly placed, uh, pfft. Uh, I had something on my arm. I was trying to blow it off. That it awkwardly placed the uh, life crystal. <laughs> Oops. Um. I've seen so many chests and I can't even open any of them because the game's not giving me any keys. This is definitely a problem. I haven't received a single key whatsoever. It's not the game knows. Yeah, I've gotten coins and nothing more. More, all I keep finding are chests that I can't open at all. It stinks. I know that much. Oh, hi there. I want so I can only imagine how much of the dungeon I've uh oh come here thank you give me your key Forceful, forceful magic missile. Hmm. Alright, so I'll grab that. I kind of expected that a mile away. Alright, um, get rid of you. Get rid of you. Alright, I am definitely getting loads of money. I'm not gonna lie.
I don't understand though. It's how I'm getting absolutely no keys. That's definitely something a statue you haven't seen yet. Oh, those are actual furniture. Okay. Wasn't aware of that. Another chest. Yeah, I still have not gotten any, um, Yeah, legitimately all the keys I've found so far have been from those slimes, and nothing more. Which is quite strange, I must admit. My god, all the stuff I'm getting from these. Oh shit. Not mean to do that. run I'm having in this is ridiculous. Hey, you have two golden keys finally. Do this to me, game. I see. Yeah, the dungeons are definitely pretty damn huge now. Oh my god, jeez. Okay. Can I just look in the chest please, game? Allow me to do this. I'm gonna take out that fucking dart trap too. There you go. I still got a key with me, so... That was a strange thing to come across.
You can see that the dungeons really aren't that easy, even now. <laughs> Last I hit the actual bottom of this uh, area. Ow. Yep, it seems like I did hit the bottom of the dungeon, so only thing one one only one thing left to do and that's to go right back up again. What a gauntlet, though. I must admit. Here's a route I haven't gone up yet. Nazar. Wow. That's an, that's another new item right there. So there is new items here. Oh, is there new items here? And you got another key. Now I'm starting to see myself getting some keys. Finally. That intrigues me. You know what I'm gonna do? Playing a bunch of those. So that way it'll show up on the map and I'll be able to identify where those two chests are. Cause that's interesting. Oh god, another golden key. Good. Oh, it's just a regular chest, I see. So I reached another dead end. See now I'm finding the keys, but now I'm not even finding the chests I was I was locating. Oh, there are spiked balls in, in the dungeon. Okay. Apparently they're quite rare though, because those are the first two I've seen. Oh no, there's more. I spoke too soon. 
What the hell is this? It's, it's, it's like a tornado icon. What is that? There's some very unique chests in this dungeon. You know what? I'm probably going to have to come back here. You know, there's no doubt in my mind. I think this is something related to hard mode. I'm really curious on the... On the, uh... Reasonings behind those chests. They must have something huge in them. That's my only guess. Dart trap removed. I'm definitely cleaning house on this uh place though. A handgun. I don't know if I uh had that before. <laughs> Tell you one thing though, I think the uh, dungeon is pretty damn covered now. <laughs> I'd say I got through the vast majority of it at this point. Boy, there's a lot of people on my friends list playing Terraria right now. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. More than likely, I will be playing more Terraria later on though. I, I'm pretty certain of that. I'm pretty certain of that. Damn, uh, and catch up. Damn, another shadow key. Well, I'm gonna stop right here just for a moment. But I will see you guys for the next episode of Terraria. But for now, this is signing out. I'm gonna continue going through this dungeon. Sayonara, guys.